right, you guys. Tommy here. I'm back. Fresh episode of Outdoors with T. Indoors today. And uh, we got this channel cat here that I caught on Outdoors with T. Got some uh, Cajun fish fry in this bag here. And you just simply load up, rinse your fish, some water, let it drip dry, and load it up in the bag. Alright. If I could get you to shut that for me. We got some uh, grease right here already heated up. As you can see, we already did a batch. So you just get it in there and you give it a nice toss. So yeah, T here. Thanks for tuning in. We appreciate you guys. So this is just some channel cat I caught out of the Des Moines River on Outdoors with T. And you just give it a nice toss in your Cajun seasoning. And we're going right into the hot grease with it. As you can see, she's roaring and ready. We're going to load her up. Oh yeah, that's sizzling nice there. So yeah, I just wanted to make a quick video of how we like to fry our fish. And uh, it's been really hot, so I haven't been able to get outside. So I figured I'd make a quick video on catfish fry. Good old fashioned catfish fry. Alright. That's that. Give my hands a quick rinse in here. Alright. And I like to take my tongs and make sure everything's kind of spread out a little bit so it can fry evenly. Get it up against, off my wall there. All right. Really appreciate you guys tuning in again. I hope you all are having some luck out there. I have a freezer full of fish. That's why I haven't had no videos of me bringing any home lately. So we're going to go ahead and get some of that out of the freezer. Have ourselves fish fry for dinner. Friday night. Fresh video. These were anywhere from one to three pound channels that I caught, which in my opinion is perfect eating size. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and start flipping. Actually, I'm going to save those for when I get it out. I like to use a fork to flip. Keeps me from breaking all the breading off.
real simple here guys clean up your fish dip it in the batter put it in the pan we're using Crisco frying blend soybean and peanut oil for our oil today Got the good old cast iron out. Those are looking good, guys. Can't remember for sure if everything got flipped but it looks good to me and yeah we're using that this is the spicy blend Louisiana fish fry spicy blend you just throw it in the bag let it drip dry throw it in the bag and shake it around super easy guys and we got some cornbread over here for dinner and some green beans some fried fish. Oh yeah, it's gonna be the bomb. I'm excited. Can hardly wait. I want a piece now. Smell good, baby. It does smell delicious. And that's gonna hold some heat. This is getting close to being done. I cut it. Cause it'll keep frying guys. It's nice and hot. Take this fish off. Yeah, absolutely. Let me take it off for you. One switch. Perfect. All right, guys. As you can see, we already got some down in there. Mm. All spicy. This is a mixture, and I'm just gonna pull this piece off, and we're gonna give her a taste test here. And then, pull the rest off. That'll be extra hot, and it'll just come out. But I don't mind. Looks real good. Mm. Oh yeah. Alright guys, it's all coming off now. We love ya. Get out there, get yourself some fish, bring it home, and cook yourself a nice homemade meal for the family, guys. Good old catfish. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed what you've seen. Be expecting more from Outdoors with T real soon. We appreciate you. We'll talk to you soon.